Hi, I'm Bailey Osteen and this is G-Star Documentaries. Today, we got an interview with the Mr. Crane, the most esteemed staff member of G-Star, most critically acclaimed. Um, he's won a couple awards at graduations and stuff. Um, and we're gonna be able to interview him today. I'm very excited. Um, this opportunity doesn't come a lot, so I'm hoping it's great. And this is our first documentary of G-Star Documentaries. So let's get it on. Mr. Crane, uh, it's nice to meet you finally. It should be. Oh, well, uh, uh, I'm just, I'm so glad you got me this interview. I've been working real hard starting this podcast, starting, you know, the G-Star documentaries page. And, uh, you know, finally nice to get an interview. So, uh, should we get on? We should. All right. Uh, the first question that, uh, that was voted by students, they said that, when caught with a vape device, what what is the absolute maximum punishment for that? Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh okay. We'll, we'll, we'll go on to the next question. When coming up with the expulsion punishment, what exactly entails that? What, what does, uh, what, what, what's the minimum to be expelled? Uh, I don't like you. <sighs> okay, uh, what are your plans on making the lunch courtyard better since we can't really do a cafeteria? Do I eat there? I go out to lunch, so whatever you guys do at lunch is your business. It's got nothing to do with me. So you... Wouldn't that be... I feel like that's a, you know, something that you wouldn't want to do because your job kind of exists here. So, like, why would you go off campus to, uh, to go get food when you're supposed to be here? Okay, are, are you a straight A student? Um, no, not myself. Yeah, exactly. So why are you telling me how to do my job? I was, I was just asking. That's the whole point. It's, and I answered, I don't care what happens at lunch, that's your problem, not mine. I go to a nice restaurant, sit down, and eat my lunch like a normal human being. Next question. Students are known for uh, vandalizing the bathrooms. What do you plan to help that stop, to prevent that from happening in the future? Uh, well, again, I don't use those bathrooms. So whatever you guys do in there and you feel like you want to hang out there and make your stupid little TikToks or whatever in there and it looks like the way it looks, then that's on you. Not my problem. Uh, right. Just a few more questions. Uh, why the office change? Uh, well, a Officially, the office changed because Mrs. G needed more space. Uh, unofficially, uh, the office changed because Mrs. G just couldn't stand being around me anymore. Why would that be? Because she doesn't have a sense of humor. Chicks just need to learn to laugh. Right. Uh... <clears throat> So, when it comes to senior year, my senior year, happy 2023, class of 2023, um, when it comes to the graduation of the class of 2023, do you plan on participating at all? I go to every graduation because I make a buttload of money. I win every single bet. When it, uh, next question, uh, actually talking about the salary what how much do you make as a teacher is it true that it's uh in words that are listed on here criminally low uh it's definitely criminally low which is why i do side gigs you know like most people in education you know but that's not something that you know anybody here needs to know about side gig side gigs yeah such as well like i said nobody here needs to know about it there are, right. there are alligators in the canal for people who ask too many questions. Um, 
when one last question before I go. Thank God. Um Do you like working here at G Star? Seriously? How long did it take you to come up with that question? Well, thank you so much for having me. It was uh, an interesting interview. Well, I'm glad it was for one of us. All right, thank you.